What's going on guys? Welcome to another episode of My Blunt Opinion. Today we are going to be reviewing the Dog Walkers Show Dog pre-roll, infused pre-roll. This strand is sit, so it is a indica, that's how they name it. The strand is brownie scout. Sit is for indica, stay is for sativa. In this pre-roll, it is 48.59% THC. Now, Dog Walkers Show Dog is one of my new favorite strands. I kind of slept on this strand for a little bit. So yeah, I'm gonna try to make this a short video and get it going. As you know, we're gonna go through the checklist from packaging to consistency to all the other categories. So we're gonna get to it. And um, as far as as far as packaging is concerned, is the packaging visible and appealing and informative? Yes, yes, and yes. It's a little appealing, you know. Packaging. That's all it really is to it. As the sit, stay. I kind of like their their brand, their marketing scheme. Not scheme, but their marketing plan. They are basically basing it on you know you're going on a walk with your dog. You know, light a joint, light a joint while you walk your dog. It's a great idea, actually. This is a, yeah, one gram pre-roll. Sorry about that, one gram pre-roll. And there's the pre-roll right there. Yeah. So packaging, I am going to give it a, I'm gonna give it a three, cause they could definitely do better. Even though I like their, I like the name, I like the premise. Give it a three. Now, construction and quality. The roll quality is the pre-roll packed and evenly tight. I would say so, and tight. That's what she said. And yeah, very, very nice. Let's spark it up and uh, see how we can do. Now, just like the bagel hole, you want to give it a slow burn. I mean, a slow pull. Now, I like these because they burn even. They have a nice taste. They burn even, they have a nice taste. And, um, I think you guys would be very happy with it, honestly. Very, very happy. Smokes a lot, which is, I don't know if you guys like that or not. I like, I like a lot of smoke. I could pretty much put this down. This thing will still be burning. Uh, construction and quality, pre-roll packed even tight. Uh, let's give it a four. I'm gonna try to stay away from the 0.5s just to give it a nice even number. Burn experience. Definitely burns even. And it's burning nice and slow too. Nice and slow. All right, so burn experience. Burn experience, we're gonna give it a five. Aroma, does it smell fresh or stale? It smells fresh as hell. Intensity, does it smell strong or weak? Going off of smell and not smoke. The smell, it's not it's strong. It is there. The smell is there, but it's not overpowering. You know, it's nice. Uh, the scent, it's the scent profile. I would say would be floral, a little earthy, more floral. Not so much skunky. Sweet taste. <coughs> oh, this thing has me choking. So aroma. I'm gonna give it a four. Flavor. I honestly wanna say like tastes like a and this is not a bad thing if I'm trying to see what it tastes like. I don't know why. I'm getting the taste of cocktail sauce. I don't know why. It's weird. But the name is called Brownie Scout. I don't taste no brownies. It's not a bad taste at all. Trust me, don't think too much about the cocktail sauce thing. It, it, it tastes more like a sweet. It's very good. You won't be disappointed with this with this pre-roll at all. It almost has like minty taste, but now, now you feel the heaviness. Now I feel the heaviness on the chest now. It's this, this, this little one gram pre-roll really packs a punch. Don't sleep on the dog walkers. The one gram. Five gram, smoke two, three of those to get a little something. The one gram, it's very, very, very good. I'll give it a fruity taste. All right, so flavor, this is supposed to be a quick video. Flavor, let's give it a four. This is one of my favorite strands. Effects, onset time. How quickly do you feel the effect after smoking? 
right away actually I, I feel it right away after i smoke that mental effects you feel euphoric i feel relaxed but up at the same time almost like if i smoked a hybrid but this is an indica which is a good thing you don't want to be you're down and out your indica is uh, damn definitely a body high feel more creative more excited more focused a little bit wow all right you know what let me give that a five like i said this is a very good very good brand and if you can find the brownie scout get that too i'll let you know where i found that at the end of the video the potency of the thc content what was that 48 percent thc 48.59 give that a five smoothness is harsh on the throat and lungs doesn't make you cough it does make me cough and the resin buildup is not crazy again this is a very well packed pre-roll i don't know if i'm gonna get demonetized for this or not but i don't care anything i might have to put this on uh patreon so let me know if you guys still want to watch it if they stop me from putting this type these type of videos on youtube then i'll just go to patreon but let me know what you guys think in the comments huh? smoothness harshness is a smooth it is smooth let me give that a four value price point Whew. good question what was the price <laughs> $25. And as you can see, they only have one left. Yeah, one left. But $25. And uh, it's worth it. Worth every penny. So I'm going to give that a five. And overall experience. Overall experience. I am satisfied. I give this shit a 10 out of 10. Well, not 10 out of 10 because the packaging. Packaging is the only thing that could really mess it up. But uh, mess up the score, I should say. If you're not really into packaging, you don't care, you're just gonna rip it open and smoke. This is the pre roll to do it. So, for overall experience, I'm gonna give it a 4.5. Damn, I think I gave the bagel hole a 4.5 too, didn't I? To me, these episodes, I'm always going to show, not always, because I'm gonna show you some bad ones too. I don't really wanna smoke bad, who wants to smoke bad pre rolls, but, or bad product anyway. So, what I suggest to you guys is going to be high quality good smoke i don't want to show my publicized bad stuff it's just not your thing. But if i run up on a bad one then we'll see i'll let you know definitely so i wanted to make this a short video i don't think it's gonna be, it might be shorter than the last one so let me know what you guys think in the comments thank you so much for the support Last video, like I said, if YouTube stops me from doing these videos, then I'll just move it on to Patreon to watch it. Let me know what you guys think, though. Next pre-roll is going to be a kind of, got like a whole bunch of them. Knock these videos out. The next pre-roll is going to be, well, we have a couple. I have a regular pre-roll, a regular non-infused pre-roll, which is called the Headspace pre-roll. The strand, I'm not going to tell you yet, but that will be for the next episode. I want to catch it up and not do all infused because infused can be expensive i know so uh, we are moving and trying to stay consistent but stick with me guys and i am like i said let me know what you guys think in the comments and uh, this is dr hayes out more content coming soon hey guys stay lifted